I stopped counting how many rockets I've done. So it's one of those things where like I could do it blindfolded, I think. But the magic position is definitely a tough, uh, it's tough to put a description on it because there's just so many things that, that we do as um, managers. It's, uh, I mean, this is just one of the things that I do. It's a constant pull electronic string machine, I guess. Um, I mean, it's similar to like what you see all the top guys using, like Federer and Adal. I mean, the tighter the racket, um, generally the more control the, the players will have on the ball. But it's all personal preference, um, where like where your tension is, sort of. So I mean, a looser racket will generally give you more pop and power on the ball. Um, so different players like a different feel out of the racket. Um, <laughs> you route the racket on it, and then um, you grab like 40 feet of string, and then um, you kind of just. I don't know how to explain it. It's like, it's, you basically just weave the holes through. Once you have a string in there, you're kind of just, the machine does all the work for you. You just gotta like put the, um, you just gotta uh, do everything, like moving the string around the racket basically. It's, it's definitely nice to have like someone like, like a stringer on site. That way like it's, um, the player's always like, all the rackets feel exactly the same, same stringer. Um, they don't have to worry about things feeling a little different because, um, it could actually, I mean, the, I mean, the rack is pretty much like an extension of the player's hand. So I, if it feels weird to them, it'll definitely affect their game in the, uh, during those big matches. I've watched like Breaking Bad, um, Sons of Anarchy, and like Friday Night Lights all while stringing. And like, I, I mean, I guess I found the perfect job. <laughs>